Hi guys and welcome to this week's Alakazam video blog. This week I am joined by Andy Smith. How are we? Yep, very well. Yeah, oh, very good. good. And this week we're going to be talking about streaming videos. Now we're going to show you three effects, three different effects from different streaming videos. I mean, streaming videos have kind of come from nowhere in the past couple of years. Yeah. They, yeah. They're the instant way to learn magic. Yeah, it always it always was very hard. Certainly when I got into magic, that if you wanted to see uh, some of the top flight magicians, the only way you were going to see them was a, a lecture. Yeah. If you were lucky at your local club or uh, Blackpool was really yeah. the only other option to see top flight performers. Yeah. Um, or if they were doing a lecture tour, possibly. Um, but it it wasn't easy. And now, click, click of a button. button. Yeah. Jinx. And it's yeah, <laughs> it's it's there. It's it's instant. It's instantaneous. Yeah, and we have got a huge selection of videos to choose from, which are great. We also have a brand new one that's just gone up on the site, and that is one of the reasons you're joining me today. Yeah. So you can show these guys, tell these guys a little bit about your new effect. Yeah. Which is called the Twins Legacy. Yeah, um, a little while back uh, we did a cover on the Bob Austin book. Great book, loads of great ideas in there. Um, mixed bag of, of stuff, lots of great carved material. Um, and there's a trick in there called Twisted Twins, um, which Peter immediately um, sparked Peter's interest. Yeah. Uh, Peter then worked out a handling which he called Really Twisted, um, which is a video that you, you get when you purchase the Bob Austin book for our site. Yeah. Um, it's a great effect. Um, when he worked it out, um, as is always the case, he showed us. Yeah. Um, and then I looked at it and I kept revisiting it. I went home that night and I'm thinking, do you know, there's some other things that you could do with this. And then over a period of, it was actually quite a long time, I worked out um, lots of different variations, um, three specific variations, I, I should say. Um, and if you want, I'll, I'll show you one of the variations. Sounds awesome. So let's go uh, to footage now or one of the variations from the twin twins legacy. legacy there we go so dave people say to me um can you cheat at cards do you have to learn sleight of hand to be able to cheat at cards and the truth of the matter is is that actually the cards do everything for me i tell you what look i'm just going to give these a quick shuffle up um, and another shuffle uh, to keep things fair or more or less fair uh, Dave, if you don't mind, could you just reach over and uh, cut off a packet of cards for me? About a third. And if you turn them face up, that's brilliant. Um, and what this does is this actually marks a space, uh, a place rather, just here, um, in this card. Now, we don't need to know what this card is um, because the cards are going to tell us. Uh, in fact, look, all I do is I take the card and I throw it through the pack like that. And something strange happens. One card and one card only turns face up. Now this card tells me that this card here is a high card. This card here, that tells me that your card is the opposite of colour, so this would be red. And this card here, well this card here, that tells me that your card was a queen. I think it's fairly safe to say that this is a queen. Uh, Dave, if you don't mind, could you just uh, pick that up and um, turn it over? And is it a queen? Yeah. Yes, it's the Queen of Diamonds, but that's quite a good hand. In fact, it's not the best hand. You see, Dave, what we could do is we could change these cards just here to aces. Watch. Turn them over. And I think you'll find that actually that's nice. a far better hand. So that was one performance from the Twins Legacy. If you want a bit more information about that, head over to the site and you will see the product on there and a couple of videos as well, a couple of different yep. handlings for the effect. Yeah, um, there's there's three handlings on there, but in all honesty, um, I think I even say on there that you can just take it and run with some, some different ideas uh, from that anyway. Um, and it's a, a special introductory price at the moment as well. Um, so it's at $3.99 uh, and it will go up to $5.99 um, whenever that, that happens to be. Um, so getting quick. Okay, so that is the Twins Legacy. For those of you who are yet to purchase a streaming video and not sure of the process, we have a free streaming video for you. It's called Further Thoughts by John Carey and it is on the streaming video section of our website. All you have to do is log into your account, purchase a streaming video as if you were to, to buy it, but it 
it won't take any money off you because it's free and then it'll be in your account. It'll be in the My Streaming Videos section of your login account. Click on it, the video will be right there and you can play and learn the effect. So I'll show you the trick, it's called Further Fort. Yep. Pack of cards, Andy. Actually what I'd like to do is to mix them up. Start with a shuffle, I guess. You can do a couple of cuts as well. You're quite good at that. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, give them one last shuffle just to make it very okay. fair. And what I'd like you to do is to cut the cards. Perfect. Uh, and cut again from whatever packing. Happy? Yeah. And I'd like you to push two towards me. Yeah, and pick up one. Perfect. Leaves us with a, a packet. I want you to pick up that packet. Yeah. Have a look and remember the card. Uh, the one on the face, yeah? Yes, yeah. Okay, yeah. You got it? Yeah. Now, and shuffle them all in. Now with that card, I want you to think of the value of the card. So if it was a five, diamonds would be the five, if it was an eight of hearts, it would be an eight. Yeah? Yep. And then I'd like you to think of one of the suits, clubs, hearts, spades, or diamonds. So you're creating your card pretty much in your mind. Here. Yep. Okay. You're not thinking of a red card, are you? I am. You are, okay, I thought so, this is weird. Uh, if I go through here. And I put that down. What I'm gonna ask you to do is to go through these cards and remove the card that you're merely thinking of. <laughs> it's not there, Dave. It's not there? It's not there. What was the card you were thinking of? The Three of Hearts. The Three of Hearts? Yeah. Right, okay, let me just recap this, because this is pretty impossible. You've shuffled and mixed the cards, you've cut the cards, you've now got a card in your mind. Yeah. And it was a Three of Hearts? It was. There's one card on the table here, I want you to turn it over and show everyone that card. Yeah. It's a Three of Hearts. Is that cool? That is very cool. <laughs> that is very cool, Dave. It's called Further Fort. It's very, very easy to do. You'll be glad to hear. You do it from a shuffle pack of cards. And it's taught to you by John Carey. It's one of John Carey's effects. It's on our website now. It's called Further Fort in the streaming videos section of our website. Right, so Andy, we've got our own streaming videos that we do and produce ourselves. Yeah. There's also some other ones that they could purchase as well. Yeah, um, mainly the at the table lectures uh, that come from Murphy's. Um, over the last year or so that they've been popular, um, they have been growing in number, different magicians that are on there, top flight magicians, and some that really you're unlikely to see anybody uh, anywhere else, because yeah. they don't lecture that often, but Murphy's have managed to get them for the at the, at the table things. Um, the good thing about those is that when the dates go up for when they're being uh, shot, uh, you can log in if you want to and watch it live. Yeah. So it is literally as if you're sitting there live with the person uh, watching a lecture. Um, then I think it's about 48 hours after that, it's available to you um, as, a, as a permanent streaming video that you can then go back and watch. Or if you miss the live aspects of it, yeah. you can then watch it 48 hours later uh, because obviously they need time to get the filming uh, edited if they need to a little bit. Um, and then put up on on the site. Um, so it's a very um, the the fact that you can see these people uh, live uh, when you want to as well with the the at the table lectures. Yeah, it's great. It, you know, it's it really good. Brilliant. I, I've got I've purchased a few. I know you have, yep. and and they are great fun. And you know, it, it's just nice to see that magician that you wanted to see live. You know, performing stuff. So it, they are really great. As I did say at the beginning, we do have obviously produce our own streaming videos, and we have an, another exciting one coming yeah. very, very soon by a young gentleman called Lewis Tranter. Now, for those of you who don't know Lewis, he's a very, very creative yeah. young magician, and you have to keep your eyes out for him because some of his stuff is incredible. He showed us loads of stuff, loads of tricks when he came into the shop the other week. One in particular kind of left Peter scratching his head uh, is a very, very visual moment of magic and it's going to be his first streaming video and it's called Punched and we're going to allow you to see the trailer for that right now. Hi, my name's Lewis Tranter. Welcome to Punched. Right, have a look at it. 
shirt around to me. Got okay. it. Right, um, here you can open the pen. Okay. You're stronger than me. That's on it. Show the camera again, just so they know what it looks like, okay? Right. Place the card right there for me. Okay, it goes pretty much in the centre of the pack. I'm going to take this card, the six of diamonds, and it has six holes in. Right. Now watch this. It's going to find your card. Watch one, two. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> goes all the way down into the pack. Just like that. There's the six of diamonds. And there's your card. Wow. I Mate, mean, that's so visual. <laughs> that's great. So that was punched by Lewis Tranter. Yeah. I'm sure you'll agree, it looks awesome, but most importantly, it's really, really easy to do. Yeah. You create that very visual moment of magic, which I guarantee you looks as good in front of your eyes as it does on camera. You know, we try to get the camera as close to, uh, to the shot as possible so you can see it. It really looks like it just melts away. It was, it was one of those moments when Peter saw it and he was like, Dave, and yeah. then you looked here yeah. and, and you were both like Andy and <laughs> we were just literally, we were, we were gobsmacked because it was kind of, like you said, it was one of those things where you're just watching it and you're thinking, there's no, nah, yeah. there's no way, but you know, and it, and very, very clever. Us, when he showed us how it worked, it was just genius, yeah. very simple, very practical, workable. So keep your eyes out for that, that'll be on the website within the next week, I believe. Yep. And we're going to finish on another streaming video. Ooh. One last one you might like. This is one for myself. Uh, this is called Location. Uh -huh. So I'm going to show you that. Now, pack of cards. Well shuffled and mixed. Yep. Okay. Here's the idea. The idea of this trick is that it's going to be out of my hands. A lot of this is going to be completely out of my hands. Okay. Um, so first off, I want you to take the cards. Hold them in your hand. Yep. And I tell you what, you're going to spread them between your hands. Uh, face down, face yeah, up. Yeah, face down. Yeah. And then you, when you're when you're happy, you just place one down on the table, and it's imperative that I don't see it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, put the cards back on top. Cards down here. I want you to have a look at the card and show the guys at home as well. Just cut these. Good. Yep. And pop it down here. Don't let me see. I want you to pick up one of these piles and shuffle the cards. Yeah. And shuffle that card into them as well. So there's really no way I can know what your card is, and I genuinely don't. I want you to then take these, yeah. put them on the table, yeah. pick these up, yeah. mix them up, and cut those cards, and pop these in there, and then put the rest on top. I mean, I. Is that fair? That's fair. Yeah, <laughs> that is fair. There's no way I've really touched any of this or could know what your card is. So for me to go through now and try and work out what your card is, it's a general idea of this trick. <laughs> Let me try this. You've got one in your mind though, right? Yeah. I'll tell you what, let me see if I can work out which part this is in. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I think, I think, if I put this over here, I think it is in this part here. Yeah. I want you to think of your card. Yeah. Because I'm going to take it invisibly out of the pile. Now that might sound stupid, but if I'm holding your card here, it couldn't possibly be in this pack here. No. Nope. It's not. No. The people at home automatically think they will be in this pack here. Yeah. But it's not, it's invisible. So only when I take it and place it inside the box, <laughs> if you can hear that. It's one card now inside the box. Now, genuinely, you held these cards the whole time. I did. You cut and mixed them up. Yeah. You decided the order, but there's now one card. Oh, by the way, 
It's not in here, right? There's no duplicates here. This genuinely is a card. Yeah. And it could be signed. What was your card? Queen of Spades. Take it out, have a look. And there it is. The Queen, Queen of Spades. Of Spades. Uh, and that is location. It's basically I wanted a under impossible. That's, you know, that is great. The, the box thing is, is an added addition, which I do go through on there. But the main thing is being able to find that card under impossible conditions with a, well, it is a normal pack of cards. Yeah. So it's very easy to do again. That one's called Location by Myself. So that brings us towards the end of this week's Alakazam vlog. Aww. I know, I know, it's been great. And you know, keep your eyes out. We've got a lot of exciting projects coming very, very soon on streaming video. One that we done together. We did. Called the Jumpstart Project, volume one, two, and three. Which basically, if you're a beginner and you've always wanted to learn the card slights, you want to take it away from gimmicked cards and gimmicks. You want to learn all the slights from even holding a pack of cards all the way up to some really great routines, then that is the Jumpstart project that will be for you. Also, we're gonna be using streaming videos as a tool for you to learn brand new handlings for effects that we release. So Limitless has got uh, free, I believe, streaming videos up there of extra handlings. On every single disc or in the packet, you're gonna get a code. That code is a registration code that you go onto your login section of your account and you can type in your registration code there and it will bring up the video for you. So we use it for that as well. So keep your eyes peeled. Got all these exciting new things coming out very, very soon. And if you want to be the first people to hear about it, then make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and of course, follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Andy, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, guys, and I'll see you next week on the Alakazam video blog.